Hello and welcome to this step-by-step -step video in which we will show you how to use the Recent Apps key to access menus and options when navigating around the Galaxy S5. Using the Recent Apps key can help you switch from your current application to another recently used application. On the Galaxy S5, when you tap the bottom left key on any screen you are viewing, the Recent Apps screen is displayed. Next, Tap on any app used recently to switch to that app. To close open applications not in use, tap on the Active Applications icon. Tap on End next to any app you wish to close, or select End All to close them all. Alternatively, tap on the End All icon when you're in the Recent Apps screen. If you tap and hold the left key, you can access additional menu options for the current screen. When viewing the home screen, tapping and holding the Recent Apps key will enable you to access additional settings options for the home screen, home screen widgets and home screen wallpapers. If you tap and hold the Recent Apps key when in the Apps screen, you will see the Settings menu. You can also tap on the More icon to display the Settings menu options. Similarly, you can access the Settings menu for various preloaded Samsung applications. For example, tap Phone on the home screen. Then tap and hold the Recent Apps key. The Settings menu options are now displayed. You can also press and hold the Home key to launch the Google Now application. If you press the Home key twice, you can access the S Voice app. Press the Home key once briefly to return to the home screen. If the multi-window feature is enabled, you can quickly access the feature by pressing and holding the back key. Please note, if you have not enabled the multi-window feature on your device, you can do so by tapping Apps in the home screen. Then tap Settings and scroll down to Multi-Window. Next, tap on the Multi-Window icon and drag the Multi-Window setting switch to the right to enable the function. Please follow these tips carefully to prevent damage to the device and to maintain the water and dust resistant performance. Keep your device dry and avoid immersion in water. Gently wipe dry after exposure to liquid. Avoid exposing your device to water at high pressure or in situations where there is fast running water. For example, in the sea, under a shower. Do not use a screen protector. This causes sensor malfunctions. Ensure that the back and multi-purpose jack covers are tightly closed, otherwise they may not provide the protection from water and dust. Do not open the back cover using wet hands or when the device is wet. That's it! You've just learned how to use the Recent Apps key to access menus and options when navigating around your Galaxy S5.